welcome back to my channel and today we're going to be talking about Cramathon and here is my little bullet journal spread through Cram Cramathon I cannot talk and they are having it through August 2nd through August 4th so it's a three day Cramathon for over the weekends and they have some challenges that I have written down here and then I'm gonna talk into my T into my TBR about it I yeah I don't know why I was gonna go with that one but anyway without further ado let's just get into this Cramathon video shall we don't know why we're talking like that but we are okay for the challenges the first one is read it a book less than 200 pages and for that one I'm gonna go with scary stories to tell in the dark this is also being turned into a movie that's also coming out in August that I want to go watch so hopefully get this read so that I can go and see the movie because it looks really good and really creepy and Halloween vibes, please. That is what we need on in my life. <laughs> Alright. Moving on. Challenge number two is to read a 2019 release. Now for that one, I am definitely going with The Devouring Grey by Christine Lynn Hurman. Now I've heard a little bit about this and I've heard good things about this as well. So I am definitely intrigued to get to The Devouring Grey and I have sections off that I want to read into. So I'm thinking we can definitely get this done, start it late Friday, right at midnight, as soon as Cramathon starts, and see what we can do with this one. Hoping to, to get through all of these books that I picked out, but definitely this one is probably one of the ones I'm looking forward to reading. Alright, the next challenge is give an author a second chance. Now for that one, I'm going with Courtney Summers, Crack It Up To Be. I read her other older book called Some Girls Are this year, and I hated it with a passion. I'm so sorry. I tried to get into it and tried to like it, but that one, I pushed through just to say that I read it. Don't get me wrong, I love Sadie by this author, but I want to give this one a try, so yes, we're going to do that. I don't know a whole lot about Cracked Up To Be, but that's okay, I like to go somewhat blind into my books, so that's what we're going to do with this one, and hopefully we like it. And then the last and final challenge is finish three books. That right there is three books, but I left the fourth one open, but <laughs> this is a beast, yes, and I really need to read Obsidio because this is the third and I think maybe final book in the Illuminae series. I have the audiobook for it, so I'm going to try to double speed this one and hopefully try to get it done by Sunday, the latest. So... Yes, please, I need to know what happens to the rest of the cast from the first two books, and I think there might be new people in this one, not really sure, but as long as Aiden doesn't come back, I almost forgot his name, <laughs> that's how bad I didn't like Aiden, <laughs> but as long as he doesn't come back and tries to take over the ship and Caddy and all of them, to take them down, but we shall see what happens in Obsidio. And there you have it, you guys. That, this, I don't know if I can hold it without it dropping. This is my little stack for Cremathong, and I'm super excited about it. And, yes, that's just my first 
half of the week's TBR. And that's all I have for this video. I'm so sorry. I'm all over the place. But if you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. You know, right down there. Or one of those corners. Just, you know, click it. Hit the notifications. Because you don't want to miss further videos from me. I try to upload when I can. I don't really necessarily have a set schedule on when I upload. I just sometimes say, surprise, here's some videos. But anyway... I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.